Growing up, I've been very fortunate to have a brother and sister and both parents around. Our family, we would attend church every single Sunday as much as we could, and um, I, I would never really get like the message that they would always talk about, and I'd rather just daydream every time about like what I would be doing instead. My life before high school was, uh, it was, it was pretty good, but I didn't really have a relationship with God, and I knew of Him and who He was, but never had a relationship. Going into high school, uh, people can talk about if it's their best years of their life or the worst years, and for me, um, it was uh, the worst years. Uh, I was diagnosed with Crohn's disease early sophomore year, and um, that really put me through a severe depression, and I had extremely high anxiety, which would end up leading to suicidal thoughts, self-harm, and just really struggling times in my life. After coming off a rough Saturday night, um, a friend reached out to me who I haven't talked to in years in like the perfect timing and he asked me if I want to go to church with him and I was really skeptical because I thought like God's put all these bad things in my life and um, I was blaming God for these problems that I had and I felt that if God really was in control of my life like why would he do this to me and I felt ashamed like if I was to go so I was very scared but um, something inside me said that I need to go to church and see what he has to say. So I ended up going to church and as soon as I opened the doors, uh, I was greeted by Bryce and Kaylee and they didn't know me yet, but they gave me a hug and just loved on me. And that was ultimately the first time I felt loved in over a year. And that was a huge moment for me. My opinion of God changed when I accept, accepted him during a high school night. Uh, on the series of um, Blue, Black, Red, White. And um, Ryan Donovan said a prayer at the end, and he asked anyone who would like to accept Jesus into their life to accept Jesus. And I could really feel the Holy Spirit's presence surrounding me and telling me that it's okay. Like, there's nothing to fear standing up. Like, now's your time to accept him as your savior. I believe Jesus is who he says he is. He is the son of God and that he did die for our sins and that I am saved because of his grace. I'm, I'm so thankful that God has led me to 514 Church to learn ultimately more about him. Um, 514 Church has helped grow my relationship with Christ. Just seeing him completely turn and change my life around for the better and just knowing that he is, Jesus is who he says he is, and that he can change your life around has been the most uh, impacting feature of my life. My name is Robert and I'm getting baptized today to show that Jesus is who he says he is and that he can change your life around.